Ontario Place. It's Toronto's Taj Mahal, our pyramids, our palace. Built not for princes, but for people, for us. It's where innovation meets nature and asks for her number. Ontario, be proud. Our place is spectacular. But 50 years after the gates opened, it's on a list of the world's great monuments that are at risk. We've let down our Ontario place, but it's open, it's free, it's amazing, and over a million enjoy it every year. It just needs more loving, and Toronto needs more parkland. Enter Doug Ford. He's got a plan for Ontario Place. In other news, this bull has a plan for the china shop. Um, mistakes were made. And Doug wants to spend hundreds of millions of taxpayer bucks to get Ontario Place ready for developers. Rip out the native forest and hand it all over to a couple of foreign corporations. The centerpiece? An indoor spa with tropical heat all year round. Environmental costs? Never mind. Ticket costs? Begins at about 200 bucks for a family of four. Doug wants this done, and he's planning to hand the future of Ontario Place to Minister Mike Ford. But, Mike, Mike who? Wait, is he Doug's nephew? Um... Nepotism, from the Italian nipote, meaning nephew. And he wants to give our public assets to a big foreign company. What could go wrong? Oh yeah, that. Doug, there's lots of other places to build your spa. Like here, or here, or here. There's only one lakeshore. Make it a park, free for everyone. Let's not make a mistake by the lake. Let Doug Ford know, Ontario Place is for all.